All right. So here's the sound of my uh, touch-based synthesizer. It's pretty similar to the Seat Lombard Tetrazi. There's five sawtooth oscillators, five Vactrols, five piezo uh, preamps with wooden bars, and then well, the preamp generates like a short spike in voltage when you flex the bar, and then the photoresistors. The lag from them gives like a nice tail end. It sort of creates an envelope. And the the piezo preamplifiers are a Seat Lombard paper circuit that I just flat out copied. It's the Conrad Papers preamp. I'll have that linked in the description. So that's how it sounds unpatched. And now I'll start to patch it up. What's cool about the patch matrix is how quickly you're able to get like harmonic sounds from the FM and locking effects of the oscillator. You can get both the uh, metallic FM for more percussive sounds and then also simple harmonic relationships for melodies. Like here, basically, it just auto-tuned the higher oscillator to be like a fifth apart, or at least I think that's a fifth. So it's just very easy to get those harmonic relationships. It's also worth noting that I do have this going into an equalizer that's been modified to have feedback. So there's a bit of resonance there. It uh, just gives it like a fuller sound, brings out the bass. I prefer it to the dry sound, but obviously the dry isn't terrible either. I just think it's a, a good basic improvement that doesn't drastically augment the timbre. So that's more like on the melodic side, but now I'll uh, continue to patch and make it more chaotic so that you get that dissonant metallic sound out of it, because when you have these more complex relationships, you get more complex sounds, like when you have multiple sources going into the FM of an oscillator. So the circuit for the synthesizer is quite simple, and it's basically just the same thing <clears throat> repeated for as many notes as you want, because the paper circuit has both the piezo uh, preamplifier and the oscillator, and then you'd also 
and then it's just that in a vac drill. So it's quite quite simple. I mean, you can just keep making them to have more voices. They're all uh, independent aside from the power supply and being uh, pre-patched together if that's what you want to do, which is what I prefer because it's easiest. So it's just... Uh, and the oscillator is just a very basic uh, relaxation oscillator. And the four... Uh, it's you're basically just connecting to the internal uh, parts of the oscillator, and then it's protected by a resistor. So that's how you get like the FM and uh, sort of like hard sync effects. So uh, if you got any questions, criticisms, uh, concerns anything, uh, just leave a comment or email me.